Enterprise Service Bus ESB, architecture is a software architecture that provides a standardized way to integrate different applications and systems within an enterprise. It is a messaging-based architecture that facilitates communication between different applications by providing a central hub that acts as an intermediary for message exchange. The following are some key components of an ESB architecture. 1. Messaging System The messaging system is the backbone of the ESB architecture. It provides a mechanism for different applications to communicate with each other by exchanging messages. The messaging system can support different messaging protocols such as JMS, AMQP, or MQTT. 2. Message Transformation The ESB architecture provides a mechanism for transforming messages between different formats. This can be useful when integrating applications that use different data formats. The message transformation can be done using different techniques such as XSLT, Java Mapping, or Data Weave. 3. Message Routing The ESB architecture provides a mechanism for routing messages between different applications. This can be based on different criteria such as message content, destination, or priority. The message routing can be done using different techniques such as content-based routing, recipient list, or message filter. 4. Service Registry The ESB architecture provides a mechanism for registering and discovering services. This can be useful when integrating applications that expose services using different technologies. The service registry can be done using different techniques such as UDDI, WSDL, or REST API. 5. Message Mediation The ESB architecture provides a mechanism for mediating messages between different applications. This can be useful when integrating applications that have different security policies, transaction management, or error handling mechanisms. The message mediation can be done using different techniques such as message validation, security mediation, or error handling. 6. Service Orchestration The ESB architecture provides a mechanism for orchestrating services. This can be useful when integrating applications that require complex business logic. The service orchestration can be done using different techniques such as business process execution language, BPAL, business process model and notation, BPMN, or service component architecture, SCA. Certainly, here are some additional details about Enterprise Service Bus, ESB, architecture. 7. Adapters ESB architecture uses adapters to integrate with different systems and applications. Adapters are used to connect the ESB to various systems and applications, such as databases, legacy systems, and SaaS applications. Adapters can be developed in-house or can be purchased from third-party vendors. 8. Service-Oriented Architecture SOA ESB architecture is often used in conjunction with a service-oriented architecture, SOA. SOA promotes the use of loosely coupled services, which can be easily integrated and reused. ESB architecture provides a mechanism for integrating these services and can help to improve the flexibility and agility of the overall system. 9. Event-Driven Architecture EDA ESB architecture can also be used in conjunction with an event-driven architecture EDA. EDA is a software architecture that promotes the use of events to trigger actions within a system. ESB architecture can provide a mechanism for handling these events and can help to improve the responsiveness and scalability of the overall system. 10. Distributed Architecture ESB architecture is often used in distributed computing environments, where different applications are located on different servers or in different data centers. ESB architecture can provide a mechanism for integrating these applications, regardless of their location. 11. Security ESB architecture provides a mechanism for securing messages as they are exchanged between different applications. This can include encryption, authentication, and authorization mechanisms to ensure that messages are only accessed by authorized users. 12. Monitoring and Management 
ESB architecture provides a mechanism for monitoring and managing the flow of messages between different applications. This can include tools for monitoring message queues, analyzing message traffic, and identifying bottlenecks in the system. Overall, ESB architecture provides a powerful mechanism for integrating different applications and systems within an enterprise. It can help to improve efficiency, reduce costs, and increase agility by providing a standardized way to integrate different technologies and applications.